This video will explain when and how to revoke an SSL certificate from Sectigo. You may choose to revoke an SSL certificate if you are closing your business and or you are shutting down the domain. However, you must revoke an SSL certificate as soon as possible if there has been a security breach. Security breaches come in many forms and can include learning that the private key on your server has been stolen or compromised, accidentally sharing the private key instead of the public key with another party, detecting an intrusion on your web server from an outside source, or receiving a report that the private key has been made public online. Revoking ensures the certificate cannot be used. Once the certificate is revoked, you can replace it to restore security on your domain. When you revoke a certificate after a security breach, your domain will be briefly unsecured. However, an unsecured connection to a domain is better than connecting to a domain with a compromised SSL certificate, which may leave you and your customers vulnerable to data theft and other malicious activities. Start by creating a support ticket to get the process started. Use certificate technical support as the reason for the ticket. Enter as much relevant information as possible. Sectigo can process your request to revoke the certificate faster if you can provide the certificate order number, but if you don't have that information, you can provide the certificate serial number instead. Here's how to find the serial number using the Sectigo website as a generic example. Of course, you would go to your own domain and then click the padlock icon in the address bar. This looks a little different in each browser. Click Certificate if you are using Chrome. Other browsers require you to click a link or button that says something like View Certificate or More Information. When the Certificate window opens, choose the Details tab, then click Serial Number. Copy and paste this number into the description field on your support ticket. After you have submitted the ticket, call Sectigo. It may take a few minutes for your ticket to appear in the queue for our technical support team. Again, we will be able to process your request faster if you can supply your certificate order number and certificate serial number at the time of your call. After you submit a support ticket to revoke an SSL certificate, Sectigo will send a verification email to the address on your admin account as well as to the five standard default email addresses associated with your Sectigo account. Admin, Administrator, Hostmaster, Postmaster, and Webmaster at your domain. Follow the instructions in the email to confirm your request to revoke. If you want continued security on your domain, log into your Sectigo admin account and replace the certificate as soon as it is revoked. For more information and a demonstration of how to replace a certificate, see our video, When and How to Replace Reissue an SSL Certificate. And finally, note that Sectigo, like all certificate authorities, is sometimes required to revoke certificates that do not meet certificate authority and browser forum guidelines, or if malware or other fraudulent activities are suspected on your domain. Please contact Sectigo if you require assistance under these circumstances.